They don't want me to have nothing. Huh. Fuck them! Welcome back to another edition of Wrestling News here on this channel. WWE apparently broke recommended for room capacity during SmackDown. WWE needed to record all of their content at the WWE Performance Center and other close set locations. This was due to a recommendation that no more than 10 people be in a room at a single time. This per this 10 person recommendation caused AEW to nix the idea of having wrestlers at ringside even inside the massive outdoor dailies place. During Wrestling Observer Radio, Dave Meltzer brought up the fact that WWE apparently bent the 10-person limit rule during Friday Night SmackDown. During that tag match on SmackDown, I mean, I counted 13 people in that room. Whatever that is, I just noticed that we got three people at the announced desk. We got a referee, we got a ring announcer, we got four people there, and we have a couple of people running around between cameramen and sound men. So they were above that number. Whatever the number is, is it? is a cautious number. WWE did everything they could to make sure that fans have programming through WrestleMania. They also currently plan to jump right back to the WWE Performance Center as soon as they can to record more content. This is a very tricky time in human history. A lot of precautions needed to be made. When the recommendation is 10 people to a room, WWE seemed to get by with a couple more. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for Ringside News for letting me have this article for you guys. Please subscribe. More wrestling news to this channel. Unstoppable. Out. Stay in the sticks with the hicks and the fire rolls. You might come up.